welcome back to First Coast Living. Last month we had Scott of the Jacks Freebirds on to talk about this amazing event, Heroes versus Homefront, and today we are here to tell you the results of how much money was raised for the Woodruff family. So, so nice to meet both of you as well. We have Jason and Jen, and of course a special surprise. So before we get to that, Scott, tell us about the event, why this is so important, and why you chose Jason as the recipient. Sure, thank you, and good morning to all of our neighbors on the First Coast, and Jordan, good morning. Good morning. Uh, we had an outstanding day. Uh, at, the, at the Heroes versus Homefront and the Jacks Freebirds. It was, an, uh, first of all, a day of celebration of competition and camaraderie. Mm -hmm. And it actually was our best event in four years. Oh, wonderful. And so part of what we do at the Jacks Freebirds, as I mentioned the last time I was on, mm -hmm. is we look at where can we make an impact and make it in a timely way. Right. And second of all, through the Heroes versus Homefront, we look at how do we celebrate our heroes, our first responders mm -hmm. all over the First Coast. Right. And we did both of those things. That's wonderful. And so you have a box here with you. What exactly is that? I do, I do. So part of what we part of what we do in a build up to the Heroes versus Homefront is we search the community of heroes mm -hmm. to find out where is there someone who is in need. Okay. Our heroes answer the call every single time we pick up the phone and call them. So true. So how do we answer their call? When, when, they we, when they need us, yeah. exactly. And so today is our favorite day at the Jack Freebirds. Yes. And I have a number of the Freebirds with me here today. Thank you all for joining us. And it's, it's gift day. And so all the work and all the passion and the culmination of everything we put together for yeah. purposes of this event comes into this little box. Yes, this moment. Yeah, this moment, exactly. All right, well, yeah. let's present. Well, Jason, you're a hero. So on behalf of the Jack Freebirds, your community, our sponsors, this is to help you in this fight. Oh my God. How much? $30,000. Woo! Oh my, oh my gosh, that is absolutely oh amazing. Oh my God. So Jason, what does that mean to you to, to be picked? Because like he was saying, you always answer the call for others. What is it like for the community to give back to uh, you? Uh, for someone who's struggling with aphasia, uh, this is, is uh, I can't even, uh, 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 oh. the word. Come here, let me give you a hug. <laughs> I know this is so emotional. Of course, we give you that first before we say, all right, now speak. <laughs> uh, I, can't, I can't imagine uh, imagine what this has been like. Uh, and I appreciate all these guys. They've put so much on the line to make this happen. Yeah. And uh, so. Uh, between these guys helping us with it, we, had an issue with our roof, our roofer went out of business, okay. and they have stepped up and helped us to make sure that that happens. The Freebirds are amazing in our community, right. and his fellow firefighters have just done everything for us since Jason was diagnosed with a glioma. Um, How is this gonna help? Because this is huge. This is, this, it's, it is, it is it huge. It helps afford me to be able to stay home. That's wonderful. Um, instead of having to go back to work so that I can take care of him through the rest of this. Um, yesterday he finished his radiation. Oh, congratulations. So that's awesome. now he just needs a break and God, that's amazing. And this is going to help with that. Absolutely. Right, so just to let everyone know as well, you are a veteran mm -hmm. and a first responder, mm -hmm. and you were diagnosed with a brain tumor. Um, is that what that word was a that you said? A glioblastoma. Okay, because I, I didn't know if everyone knew what that I fumble was. it sometimes too, <laughs> okay. yeah. I just, I just knew we needed the help, yeah. So so what does this mean to y'all? To Like you said, out of the four years, this is the biggest check you've been able to donate. It is, and look, this just shows, honestly, more than anything else, not only our own passion, as just local business leaders and, and folks that have a passion for helping others, is it shows where our community and how our community That's feels so about true. our heroes. That's really that what it's about, so Jordan. Yeah. Well, thank you, everyone at home, thank and I'm you. so glad that you, you were here last month yeah. to be able to to use this platform. So hopefully, some of you viewers were able to. I mean, this, this is so amazing. Yeah. Well, so. thank you very much to our First Coast Living family as well. Um, big part of, of how we pulled all this together. Um, really motivated the community, fellow heroes. We were on the we were on the on the golf course, and people were handing me cash. Oh, really? All of us. Were oh, being, that's so cool. And they said, please get this to Woody. That's what this is about. That's this is why we do what we do. It's well, gift day. And thank you, Jax Freebirds, too, for everything you do. This is an annual, so I can't wait to see you again next yep, year. Yeah, we'll do it next year. All yeah, right. Thank you. <laughs> thank you again, and congratulations. Thank and I'm you. so glad that you're doing well. The radiation thank was you. over, and uh, have fun with that. No. <laughs> Enjoy your time off. Yes, ma'am. All right, thank David, you. what do we have coming up?